नमस्कार आप देख रहे हैं एपीएन न्यूज और मैं आपके साथ सुनील चतुर्वेदी चलते हैं आज की खास खबर की ओर जम्मू कश्मीर नेशनल कॉन्फ्रेंस के उपाध्यक्ष और गंदेरबल और बडगाम विधानसभा सीट से उम्मीदवार उमर अब्दुल्ला ने कहा कि हम 10 साल से चुनाव का इंतजार कर रहे हैं पहला चरण अच्छा रहा है हमें दूसरे चरण से भी अच्छे मतदान की उम्मीद है यह भागीदारी भारत सरकार की वजह से नहीं है बल्कि भारत सरकार द्वारा किए गए हर काम के बावजूद है उन्होंने उन्होंने लोगों को अपमानित किया है और सरकार की सारी मशीनरी लोगों को हिरासत में रखने और परेशान करने में लगी है इसमें मेरी व्यक्तिगत हिस्सेदारी है लेकिन सभी चरण महत्वपूर्ण है We've been waiting for 10 years. Uh, first phase went well. Uh, Inshallah, uh, we expect a good turnout from uh, the second phase also. Uh, regardless of uh, which party uh, enthusiasm and political rallies has been heartening. Uh, now we hope that enthusiasm translates into voter turnout also. So, uh, and he has invited uh, foreign diplomats uh, to. Uh, पार्टिसिपेशन is not because of government of india uh, it's in spite of everything government of india did uh, they have humiliated people they have used uh, all the machinery of the government to detain and harass people in spite of that people are coming and participating in elections so this is not something government of india should be highlighting but anyway uh, that's the way they are so you today are is a very important day for you as you are fighting from both all election days are important uh, it's not about me uh, it's about uh, the party as a whole uh, therefore first phase was as important third phase will be as important uh, yes i've got a personal stake in this uh, but for the party all three phases are important you are going to pass in two constituencies here how much you are confident you will get a positive results for both constituencies very yeah. up okay ummeed pe duniya kaam hai i'm quietly hopeful the rest is uh, first in the hands of the almighty and then in the hands of the voters so let's see uh, mahaba mukti according to her that uh, bogus voting in gandarbal area and she also yeah, but mahida wrote a letter to election commission in there to investigate uh, please investigate i can't help it if their candidates have not been able to sort of uh, make the impact that they had expected uh, it's not my fault that people have withdrawn uh, from the election campaign in my favor Uh, PDP was very happy uh, to be uh, the recipient of apni party's support in Badgam <laughs> until uh, Mahidin Muntazir sahab uh, went against his party and announced his support for me personally after that PDP got upset uh, and then started attacking us and the apni party PDP has clearly seen the writing on the wall uh, forget about Badgam and Gandarbal they'll be lucky to win even in uh, Bijbihara Uh, so I don't want to say much about it. Rahul so, Gandhi is also coming today here. In, uh, uh, but what's your opinion? Uh, good. Uh, I hope that after Rahul is done campaigning in one or two seats in Kashmir, he focuses in Jammu. Ultimately, uh, what the Congress does in Kashmir is not that important. What the Congress does in Jammu is important. And unfortunately, uh, Congress hasn't done as much in the plains of Jammu as we would expect them to do. the lion's share of the seats that the alliance gave uh, in jammu was to the congress party uh, yet uh, the congress's campaign in jammu is yet to begin and there are only 5 days of campaigning so i hope that after rahul is done campaigning on this one seat in the valley uh, the congress focuses all its attention on the plains of jammu uh, what about the overall jammu and kashmir political situation bjp claim is that the government is dependent upon the jammu government is dependent on who so i will be no no government don't you know 